We're told DeMundo was violently murdered here inside of his home. Now investigators want to speak with people who were recently here doing work. He had a hell of a spirit. He was good, he, you know. He was very well liked. A community in shock after the brutal murder of Dominic DeMundo. Around here at night after it goes dark, if you drop a pin, you can hear it a mile away. You know, there's nothing. A neighbor called police to check on DeMundo after not hearing from him. On Monday afternoon, investigators found the 95-year-old's body in his home on Wellington Drive. They found the gentleman deceased on the um, kitchen floor. Um, it was a violent scene, a violent death. Investigators won't say how it happened. Well, we don't want to put anything out there right now until we possibly find um, some suspects to interview. Neighbors tell News Channel 8 DeMundo had people in and out of his home recently doing work. The driveway and uh, the inside painting and uh, all that stuff, you know. Uh, we believe recently, possibly online, he has contacted some people and they've started showing up to his house. Um, we had heard through some people they might have been doing some work recently at the house. And Detectives want to speak with those workers or anyone who may have seen them. We don't know exactly what happened, who was let in a house, but we do find a lot of our elderly people, they're a little naive and the time they grew up was a little different than today and they have to be very careful who they allow into their house. If you have any information, call the Sheriff's Office or Crime Stoppers. In Highlands County, Melissa Marino, News Channel 8.